GM cosmonauts, today we show you how to stake Atom using Kepler Wallet. My name is Del Rey, your favorite Cosmos wizard. Let's go. First, we need to create our wallet. A wallet helps you visualize the crypto assets you have in a blockchain. So let's go to Kepler.app using Google Chrome. And on the main page, we click on install Kepler for Chrome. That is going to open up another tab for the Chrome Web Store and we can install the Kepler extension. As it says in their web page, Kepler Wallet is a convenient way to interact with the rest of the Cosmos ecosystem. The best part is that it's not custodial, meaning that you have the seed phrase that gives you control of all your crypto assets within that wallet. Once the extension is installed, let's open it up. Another tab will open with different options. You can sign in using your Google account. You can create a new account or import an existing wallet that you have already. Click on create new account. It's going to show you 12 words or 24 four words for the seed phrase remember not to share this phrase with nobody as the person that has control over the seed phrase can control all the assets within a wallet for the account name use the name that you prefer and this password is for you to access your wallet each time you close and open your browser. This one is not as important as the seed phrase. If you lose your password, you can uninstall and install Kepler again. However, if you don't have the seed phrase related to that wallet, you won't be able to access your funds. So after we written down our seed phrase and select our password, click on next. And now the wallet is going to ask you to confirm the seed phrase just to make sure you get it right. After we confirm our seed phrase, we click on register and that should be all. There are two ways to access your Kepler wallet. You can click on the extension and you can also go to their web dashboard. I find this way more comfortable because as soon as you click outside of the web extension, the extension is going to close. So once your wallet is ready, you need to fund it. There are many ways to get Atom. It is actually listed in most exchanges and it serves as the unwrap to the Cosmos ecosystem. There are two ways to find your address. You can open the web extension and see your address right below the wallet name click to copy you can also see your wallet address on the upper left corner in the web dashboard once your funds arrive to your wallet, let's get to staking. When you stake, you get your crypto assets to validators of a network. These validators reach consensus on the next block to be added to the blockchain. The more tokens they have, the higher their voting power is. That's why it is advisable to stake outside of the top 10 validators. This way, we help to decentralize the network and don't concentrate the majority of the voting power in the bigger validators. To a stake, you can use the Kepler web extension. You click on a stake, which is going to route you to the Kepler wallet web dashboard. Same that we have open here. You scroll down on the left side, click on Cosmos Hub, click stake, and here you will see the list of the validators active in the validator set. Scroll down until you find the validator of your preference. For this video, we're gonna use staking. On the stake page, you can scroll down until you find the validator of your preference. We also share a really cool article on how to select the best validator for you. The link will be in the description of this video. Once you find the validator, click on manage. You can see more information of this validator like the website and a little description. Click on delegate to delegate your funds. Once you click on delegate, you will find more information like how many tokens you have delegated to this particular validator and the available balance that you have in your wallet also the amount to delegate this warning right here just tells you when you're staking your funds are locked and if you want these funds to be liquid again you need to unstake these assets these assets will go through an unbonding period and depending on the network the amount of days will vary for at is 21 days remember to leave some dust to pay for the fees and click on delegate that is gonna pop up another window with more details about the transaction that you're doing and lets you know that you're delegating X amount of Atom to this particular validator. You will have the operator address right here. You can select the speed for the transaction. Let's leave it on average. And if everything looks good, just click on approve. And that's it. After you get the congratulations confirmation pop up and you scroll all the way up, you will see a list of the validators that you're staking to right now. So here 
here you will see the name of the validator again the amount that you stake with them and how much you have ending in rewards when the time is right you can claim these rewards and do whatever you want with them that will be all for today cosmonauts like this video and share it subscribe to stay updated about staking beware of scammers and until then cosmonauts